Hello friends, welcome. Welcome to this presentation from Rising Pearl. Hum hai aapke host aapke dost Roy. Aaye dosto aaj hum baat kar rahe hain brand new series series 3 ki aur hamari topic hai series 3 ki coordinate geometry fundamentals. Now dosto ye hai hamari webisode number 3 aur aaj ki topic hai locating locating a point in a plane. Now aapne dekha hai dosto ab tak hamare webisode 1 and webisode 2 mein we have uh, started discussing about the fundamentals of coordinate geometry. Now, humne dekha hamare webisode 1 mein, we have done like two experiments and how we realized ki kitni difficult hai to tell the exact location of a point in a plane. Then, we saw Rene Descartes was the first, um, first uh, mathematician. He was a great French mathematician. He was the first person, dosto, jinnone, he, he suggested or he invented, uh, we should say, um, the way of actually solving uh, solving the problem of describing the position of a point in a plane. So, Rene Descartes was the first person who said he using this technique system method, we can locate, give you the exact location of a point in a plane. And in his honor, dosto, is system ko, we call it Cartesian system. Right? Then, we saw in our webisode number 2, the fundamentals of Cartesian system, right? We noticed that basically what Rene Descartes suggested was that aap, if you take any two perpendicular lines, then we can always, we can always um, give the location of a point, Mandiji, if this is your point P and this is, um, these are two perpendicular lines, line L and line M. So, what Rene Descartes suggested was, you have to draw a pair of perpendicular lines. Aapko do line aise draw karni hai, two straight lines which are perpendicular to each other. And then using that, aap you can always describe the location of a point. So, in this case, agar aapko location of point P chahiye. So, what he suggested was, the location of the point P will be expressed. It will be expressed in reference to these two lines L and M. And then, so dosto, uske baad humne dekha, we drew two straight lines. Basically, we have two number lines. One which we call x axis. This is our x axis, which is this one. And then the other one, which is our vertical line, hai, we call it y axis. Right? Now, x axis ko we also write it as, as x x dash. This is our naming convention. Hai. And then vertical axis ko we write it as y y dash. Right? And jahan pe x axis and y axis the intersect, ye jo humari point of intersection hai, is point ko we call origin. And we represent this by uppercase letter Z, uh, letter O se. So, this is our origin. Then we also see uh, that once you draw two perpendicular lines, then it divides the plane into four quadrants, quadrant 1, quadrant 2, quadrant 3 and quadrant 4. And, and how do we tell which is which quadrant? Aap ye jo uh, OX hai, ye jo OX hai aapki, yahan se we go anti-clockwise direction mein and we get one by one all the quadrants. So, we start off from here and we go in the anti-clockwise direction. And first we get the quadrant 1, then we get quadrant 2, then we get quadrant 3, and finally we get quadrant 4, right? And we have also noticed in our episode 2 mein dosto, that this is your origin se, uh, x, o, x, hai, this contains all the positive x values. Origin say o, x dash, hai, that contains all the negative x values. Similarly, if you go up from, you know, from O, Y, you will get all the positive values for Y axis. And agar up O say you go o da Y dash, O, Y dash will give you all the negative values for Y axis. Now, so those are all of this is fine. Now, so how do we find out the location of a point now with, res with respect to our axis? Now, chale also, we have drawn the two, uh, we have drawn the two axes here. Now, man lije, we have to find out the location of man lije, um, this point. Yahan pe point draw karte hai, aise karke. Let us call this point as P1. Agar hume abhi, um, we have to find out the exact location of this point P1. 
सो इसे हम कैसे करके करते हैं सो फर्स्ट थिंग दोस्त वॉट वी डू इज वी ड्रॉप परपेंडिकुलर फ्रॉम पॉइंट पी वन ऑन टू एक्स एक्सिस एंड वाई एक्सिस आपको मालूम है दिस इज योर एक्स एक्सिस राइट जो आपकी हॉरिजॉन्टल एक्सिस है दैट इज एक्स एक्सिस एंड दिस वन इज योर वाई एक्सिस सो वॉट वी डू द फर्स्ट थिंग इज वी ड्रॉप परपेंडिकुलर फ्रॉम फ्रॉम द पॉइंट ऑन टू एक्स एक्सिस लेट एस कॉल दिस पी एम and then we drop perpendicular from the point p on y axis let us call this pn or or yeah or this point is n and this point is m so so those those so from point p1 actually we have dropped a perpendicular on x axis and it has intersected x axis at man lijiye point m and similarly from p1 humne ek perpendicular drop ki hai on y axis which is cutting y axis at uh, at n so now dosto aap notice karoge that p1 n jo hai which is p1 n ye hai dosto distance of this point from y axis right सो so, यानी कि ये जो पॉइंट है P1 अगर ये y एक्सिस है सो so y एक्सिस से कितने दूर पे ये पॉइंट है दैट इज गिवन बाय पी वन एन सो दिस इज बेसिकली टेलिंग अस डिस्टेंस ऑफ P1 वन फ्रॉम वाई एक्सिस राइट सिमिलरली दोस्तों आप नोटिस करोगे ये जो P1 M है दिस टेल्स अस द डिस्टेंस ऑफ दिस पॉइंट फ्रॉम X एक्सिस राइट सो सिमिलरली यहां पे जो P1 M है P1 M, दिस इज टेलिंग अस द डिस्टेंस ऑफ द पॉइंट P1 वन फ्रॉम x axis right so in this particular example dosto what we are seeing is that the distance of p1 from y axis ye jo hai this length is basically ye jo p1 n hai is the same as om because aapke ye jo origin hai this is o right so yahan pe chaliye ise aise karke likhte hain सो so, हमारी जो P1 n है दिस विच इज द डिस्टेंस फ्रॉम फ्रॉम y एक्सिस दिस डिस्टेंस इज इक्वल टू ओ एम राइट ओ एम बिकॉज इफ यू कैन थिंक दिस इज अ रेक्टेंगल राइट सो दीज ऑपोजिट साइड आर इक्वल सो P1 n एन इज द सेम एज ओ एम या एम ओ सो इन दिस केस ऑल्सो इट इज सिक्स और वी से इट इज सिक्स यूनिट्स राइट सिमिलरली आप अगर नोटिस करोगे दैट पी वन एम जो पी वन एम है पी वन एम दिस इज इट इट इज गिविंग अस द डिस्टेंस फ्रॉम एक्स एक्सिस नाउ दैट इज द सेम एज एन ओ और ओ एन ओ एन एंड दिस इज इक्वल टू थ्री यूनिट्स नाउ दोस्तों वॉट वी डू इज दैट वी से दिस पॉइंट पी वन इज सिक्स यूनिट्स फ्रॉम वाई एक्सिस एंड इट इज थ्री यूनिट्स फ्रॉम एक्स एक्सिस सो ये जो पहली वाली मेजरमेंट है दैट इज डिस्टेंस फ्रॉम वाई एक्सिस उसे हम एक्चुअली कहते हैं द एक्स कोऑर्डिनेट of the point and distance from x axis use kehte hain y coordinate of the point so so ye important hai uh, to understand samajhna ki jo point jo aapki uh, p1 hai uski distance from y axis jise you measure along x axis because ye jo distance hai aapki p1 n this is the distance from y axis right ye aapki y axis hai 
y axis say this is the distance but you measure this distance along x axis right so ise the 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 distance from y axis use hum kehte hain x coordinate and distance from x axis which is measure, measured along y axis so use kehte hain hum y coordinate and then in this case we see the x coordinate is 6 unit and y coordinate is 3 unit then dosto we write the coordinates of the point p so coordinates of p1 in this case we write this dosto within bracket pehle we write the x component then we write the y component so we write it the x and y component aise karke so the x is 6 and y is 3 so aise karke dosto we actually describe the exact location of the point p1 in the plane with respect to these two axes that that is the x axis and the y axis now dosto we want you to make sure that um, you know aap is acche se samajh sakte ho um agar if you need more time you go back you pause the video you make sure you understand it and then you can play forward this is very 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 important for you to basically understand he convention kya hai and and how are we actually finding out the location of a point now chaliye dosto we will take some more examples now abhi kya karenge we will now take a graph paper right because yahan pe we are dealing with some exact measurements so you need to have a graph paper to know exactly the coordinates of a point in a plane so ek bar hum graph paper lete hain and then next thing what we do is we draw a we draw the axis we draw the x axis and the y axis on the graph paper so humne graph paper aise karke li hai dosto and then we have drawn basically our axis so चलिए आइए लेट एस राइट द नेम्स यहां पे सो दिस इज आर ओ ये जो हमारी ओरिजिन है दिस इज लेट एस लेट एस राइट दिस एज आर ओरिजिन ओ एंड देन ये है हमारी ओ एक्स ये है हमारी एक्स डैश ये है हमारी वाई एंड ये है हमारी वाई डैश राइट एंड नाउ वी कॉल द एक्स एक्स डैश we call x x dash is equal to our x axis right similarly we call y y dash as our y axis abhi iske baad hum kya karte hain dosto jab aapne a graph paper pe you have drawn these two parallel, uh, perpendicular lines abhi aap you know you are going to uh, you know do these markings डिपेंडिंग ऑन आप जो भी यूनिट लेना चाहते हो यू हैव टू इवनली ड्रॉ दिस मार्क्स टू इंडिकेट ये है आपकी ना अलॉन्ग एक्स एक्सिस दिस विल बी वन दिस इज टू दिस इज थ्री दिस इज फोर दिस इज फाइव दिस इज सिक्स सेवन एट सो ऑन सो फोर राइट सिमिलरली यूजिंग द सेम मेजरमेंट यू आर गॉन्ट टू ड्रॉ दिस मार्किंग्स ऑन योर लेफ्ट हैंड साइड so o x dash will be having all the negative terms so you will have minus 1 minus 2 minus 3 ye hai minus 4 then minus 5 ye hai minus 6 minus 7 ye hai minus 8 right similarly o y will have all the positive y values so chaliye yahan se likhte hain this is 2 3 this is 4 5 this is 6 this is 8 similarly if you go down you will see this is minus 1 this is minus 2 this is minus 4 minus 6 minus 8 and so on so forth now dosto this is completely up to you ki aap kaise karke you you know uh, you create these marks uh, in the sense ye jo units hai hamari just like aap number line lete ho right maan lijiye agar aap yahan pe ek number line draw karte right agar aap aise ek number line draw karte so you could have said ki theek hai this is zero this is one this is two 
एंड सिमिलरली दिस इज माइनस वन माइनस टू करके और यू कुड हैव डन द सेम थिंग आप यू कुड हैव ड्रॉन अ नंबर लाइन लाइक दिस एंड आप कहते ठीक है दिस इज जीरो एंड हर एक दो यूनिट छोड़ के यू आर गॉन्ट टू गिव दम वन टू करके सो दिस इज वन दिस इज टू सो इट डजेंट मैटर दोस्तों की हाउ यू डू इट बट यू हैव टू गेट द सेम स्मॉल डिविजन सेम स्मॉल स्केल डिविजन एज अ यूनिट एंड यू हैव टू बी कंसिस्टेंट ऑन द एक्स एक्सेस ऑन बोथ साइड एंड वाई एक्सेस ऑन बोथ साइड ना दोस्तों एक बार हमारी जो कोऑर्डिनेट्स बन गई है द कोऑर्डिनेट एक्सेस जो बन गई है नाउ वी आर रेडी टू फाइंड आउट द लोकेशन ऑफ आर पॉइंट्स। 